what's up YouTube and welcome back to another Minecraft pixel art tutorial. In today's video I'll be showing you how to build Peter Griffin from Family Guy. This video was suggested by Maddie Plays, so thank you for that. Don't forget if anyone has any ideas and would like to get a shout out then make sure to drop them down in the comments section below. And if you're new here don't forget to smash that subscribe button. But if you want to know how to make Peter then here's all the materials we're going to need. Black wool, brown terracotta, green concrete, yellow concrete, white concrete, sandstone, and brown wool. So if everyone's ready, what we want to do to start this pixel art off is one black on the ground. We then want to do one up left diagonal and then go up from it by one. We then want to do another up left diagonal, go up from it by four, so one, two, three, four. We then want to do one up right diagonal and go up by one. We then want to do three up right diagonals, so one, two, three. Then we want to go right from this last diagonal by one. Again, do one upright diagonal and go right by three. One, two, three. We want to do one upright diagonal. But now we want to do two things from here. So remember this block because we will need to come back here soon. So for the first thing, we want to go right from this block by four. So one, two, three, four. From this last block we placed, we want to do one bottom right diagonal. Then go right by one. We then want to do another bottom right diagonal. And go right of it by two. Again, we want to do one bottom right diagonal. Go right of that by two. Then we'll do another bottom right diagonal. Go right of it by one. We want to do looks like this, we want to do this two more times, so one bottom right diagonal, go right by one, and another right diagonal, go right by one, just like that. From this last block we placed, we want to go down from it by one, then do one bottom left diagonal, go down by one, which should give us something that should look like this. We then want to do one more bottom left diagonal and go down from it by two. Now what we want to do is come back over to the block I told you to remember, which is the very first block of this row of one, two, three, four, this row of five. And once we're here, what we want to do is go up from this block by 12. So one, two, three, four. 11, 12. We then want to do one up left diagonal. Oh. Go up from here by five. One, two, three, four, five. We then want to do another up left diagonal. Go up from it by one. Repeat what we just done one more time. So one up left diagonal and go up by one. Then we want to do another up left diagonal, go up from it by two, one, two. Again, do another up left diagonal, go up by one, do another up left diagonal, go up by two, one, two. Then we want to do another up left diagonal, go up from here by two, one, two. We want to do another up left diagonal, go up from here by two, one, two. Then we want to do one more left diagonal and go up from here by five. So one, two, three, four, five. So once we've done that, again from this last block we placed, we want to do two things. So make sure you remember this block so you don't get confused later on. 
first thing what we want to do is go right from it by one we then want to do two bottom right diagonals so one two go down from this last diagonal by one and then go right from this last diagonal by one we want to do another two bottom right diagonals so one two and go right from this last block we placed by one then want to do one bottom right diagonal and then go right of it by one we want to repeat that again so one bottom right diagonal go right of it by one we want to do another bottom right diagonal oops go right of that by two now from this row of three we just created we want to find the middle block so this one right here i'm highlighting what we want to do is go up from here by two one two come back down to this row of three we just made and from this right block right here we want to do one bottom right diagonal so one and go right of it by two one two we then want to do another bottom right diagonal and go right by two one two do another bottom right diagonal one and go right from it by two one two from this last block we just placed we want to go up from it by two so one two and coming back down to this last block what we do is one bottom right diagonal and go right from here by 20 with our block so one two three we then want to do one upright diagonal and go right from it by five so one two three four five we then want to do one upright diagonal and go right by two one two we then want to do another upright diagonal go right and go right from it by three so one two three again do another upright diagonal and go right by one we then want to do another upright diagonal and then finish off by going right by one now guys remember that block i told us not to forget about well we need to head back over to there so it's the very corner block on the left hand side this block so out of all the things that we just made it's the very corner one on the left hand side and once we find it what we're going to have to do is go up from here by three so one two three and now from here we want to do two things so please make sure you don't forget about it but anyway if we're ready to move on then here's what we're going to need to do so we're going to need to go right by one then do three bottom right diagonals so one two three we then want to go right from this last diagonal by two so one two we then want to do another three bottom right diagonals one two three go right from here by one once we've done that we want to do another bottom right diagonal and go right from here by five so one two three four five from this last block we placed we want to go up by one but we also want to go down by one just like that this is where things get a little bit complicated so make sure to pause if necessary so from the block we placed on top this one right here what we want to do is one up left diagonal oops that always happens to me then what we want to do from here is go up by one we then want to do another up left diagonal but then from here what we want to do is go left by one white and then one black coming back to where we were starting to build this row of three so this right block right here and what we want to do is go up by one we then want to do one up left diagonal 
and go up by two. One, two. What we now want to do is go left from here by two white. So one, two and one black. Coming back to the start of this row of four we just created. So this breaks black. What we want to do is count in by one. So one, which should be this white block right here. From this white block, we want to go on top of it by three with our black wool. So one, two, three. We then want to do one up left diagonal. Then go up from here by three. So one, two, three. We then want to go left from here by one white and one black. Coming back to this row three we just made and on top of this block what we want to do is go on top of it by two so one two we then want to do one up right diagonal and go up from here by four so one two three four from the left of this last block we want to do one white and one black now coming back over to the start of this row of three we just made and from here we want to do one upright diagonal and go up by one we then want to repeat this two times so one upright diagonal go up by one another upright diagonal and go up by one now from here we want to do one upright diagonal and then from the left we want to do two white so one two and one black coming back over to the start of this row of four we just made and what we want to do is go up by one black we then want to do one upright diagonal and go up by one we want to do another upright diagonal and go up by two one two now from this middle block of three we just made we want to go left from it by one white and one black. Coming back up to this block on top of this row of three, what we want to do is one upright diagonal. Go up on top of it by two, so one, two. We then want to do another upright diagonal. Go up on top of it by two, one, two. Again, from this middle block, we want to go left from it by one white and one black. Coming back up on top of this block that we just placed on top of the row of three. And what we want to do is one upright diagonal to finish the details off. Now guys, what we want to do is come back down to the very bottom of where we just started this line of detail. So this row of three right here. And what we want to do is find the very bottom block, so this one right here that I'm highlighting. Once you've found it and ready to move on, here's what we're going to need to do. We need to go right from this block by two, so one, two. We then want to do one bottom right diagonal. Go right from it by one. We then want to do another bottom right diagonal. Go right from it by eight, so one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Then want to do one up right diagonal and go right of it by six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Again, we want to do one up right diagonal and go right from it by seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We want to do another up right diagonal. Go right from here by nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We then want to do another upright diagonal and go right by two. One, two. Then to finish it off, we want to do one upright diagonal and go right of it by one. As you guys can tell, let me just show you. This. We have done one of his shoes, we've done his belt, we've also done some detail to the top. Now what we want to do is head back over to the left hand side, which is this block right here. This one, this one, this one, this one. <laughs> I 
and on this very corner block once you've found it what we want to do well basically you should be able to find it because this is the block I told us to remember if you remembered <laughs> but once you've found it we want to go up from it with our block by one we then want to do one up left diagonal go up from it by one we then want to do another up left diagonal go up from it by two so one two we then want to do another up left diagonal but we want to go on top of this one by seven so one two three four five six seven from this last block we placed we then want to go up from it by another three one two three but from these last three block we placed we want to extend them all to the left by one so one two three just like that now this is where things get complicated do you guys see these two top blocks here but what we need to do is build from both sides so starting from the left side so this block right here and what we want to do is one up left diagonal so this block we're starting from just so you don't get confused and then what you want to do is on top of this block is go up by six one two three four five six we then want to do one up right diagonal we then want to go up from this block by one but we also want to go right from this block by one so just a little l shape from this last block we placed we want to do one bottom right diagonal we then want to come back to the top this l shape that we created so this bit here and once we're ready we want to do one up left diagonal and go up from it by three so one two three we then want to do three up right diagonals so one two three and go right from this last diagonal by one we then want to go on top of this block by two one two we also want to go down from this block by one one from this last block we placed we want to do one bottom right diagonal and then coming back to the top where we place these two blocks right here and from here we want to do one up right diagonal oops then go right by two one two what we can do now is leave this part for now we can come back to it in a bit so that's what it should look like for now so what we want to do is coming back down to these row of threes that we created and we have to extend it out to the left by one if you can remember and building from the right what we want to do is go on top of this block by one we then want to do one up right diagonal and then go up by two one two we then want to do another up right diagonal go up by one we want to repeat what we just done two times so one up right diagonal go up by one another up right diagonal go up by one from this last block we placed we want to do two up right diagonals so one two then go up by one then right by one that's the wrong way that's left <laughs> again do another up right diagonal then go up from it by one now from here we want to go left of it by one but we also want to do one top right diagonal from it as well so which should give us something that should look like that went over to where we went left by one so this block here and what we want to do from here is do one up left diagonal and go up from here by two which should connect us to the top if we've done everything correctly just like that come back down to the up right diagonal this block and what we want to do is two up right diagonals so one oops, two then go up by one then to finish it off we want to do another up right diagonal go up from it by two so one two 
it should give us something that should look like this it's that big I need to zoom all the way out <laughs> okay make sure to like comment subscribe and turn on post notifications to never miss a video but moving on now just remember when I said we'll be coming back to that row of three we made well we need to head back over to there so it's on the very left hand side I'm sort of getting mixed up with my left and right today <laughs> once we find this row of three what we want to do from the right side is go up from it by one so we're going to want to do one upright diagonal go up from here by one we want to do another upright diagonal and go up by one then we want to do three upright diagonals so one two three from this last diagonal we placed we want to go up from it by one then we want to do three upright diagonals one two three then we want to go right of it by one now from here we want to do two things so the first thing is go up from here by two so one two and then the second thing we want to do is go down from here by four so one two three four from this last block we placed we then want to do one bottom right diagonal and then go down by one we want to do another bottom right diagonal and then go down by one we then want to do two bottom right diagonals so one two and then go right from this last block by one we want to do one upright diagonal last block we want to do two things so the first thing we want to do is one bottom right diagonal so one and then go down from it by one we then want to do another bottom right diagonal and go right of it by one which will connect together with this black block and give us a upside down L Coming back to this black block that I told us that we'd be doing two things from, which is this one right here. What we want to do from this right block is go up from it by one. So if you're confused, there's the upside L that we made. So this is where we just built from. Then what we want to do is do one up left diagonal. And go up by one. We want to do two up left diagonal so one one <laughs> two from this last diagonal we want to go up by one then we want to do another up left diagonal go up by one repeat this one more time so one up left diagonal and go up by one if we've done everything correctly it should all connect together with, with one up left diagonal just like that what we now want to do from this last block we placed, this one, is go on top of it with 16 with our black wool. So one, two, three. We then want to do one upright diagonal. Go up by three. One, two, three. We then want to do another upright diagonal go up by one repeat what we just done one more time so one upright diagonal go up by one we then want to do three upright diagonals so one two three oh my god peace of your heads in the clouds <laughs> we then want to go right by one we then want to go up from this block by two so one two once we've done that, we then want to do three upright diagonals. So one, two, three. We then want to go right from this third diagonal by three. So one, two, three. Then go up from this block by one. We then want to do another upright diagonal. Then do one up left diagonal. Then do another upright diagonal. 
then go right by one repeat what we just done one more time so one up right diagonal and go right by one we then want to do two upright diagonals so one two go right from this last block by two one two we want to repeat that one more time so one upright diagonal go right by two one two we then want to do another upright diagonal and go right from it by two so basically we have to do it two, two times repeated sorry and from this last block we want to do one bottom right diagonal and go right from it by three one two three we then want to do another bottom right diagonal and go right from it by two one two we then want to do two bottom right diagonals one oh my god two and then go right from this last block we placed by one then we'll do three bottom right diagonals one two three then go down from this last diagonal by one we want to do another bottom right diagonal and go down from that block by one we now want to do two things from this block right here so don't forget it remember where the block is so it's in, basically in line with that, that L so from this block the first thing we want to do is the outline of Peter's hair so from this last block we placed we want to do two bottom left diagonals so one two and then go down by one we then want to do another two bottom left diagonals. Oops, one, two. Do one up left diagonal and go on top of it by four. So one, two, three, four. Go on top of it by one. We then want to do one up left diagonal. Then one bottom left diagonal then go left of it by two so one two do another bottom left diagonal and go left from here by four so one two three four once we've done that we want to do one up left diagonal go left from it by two one two we then want to do another up left diagonal and go left from it by one again do another up left diagonal go left of it by three one two three and if we've done everything correctly it should connect by doing one bottom right diagonal and go left from it by three so one two three which should give us something that should look like that coming back to the block i told us to remember so look over here the L shape and then we follow it and then it's this row of two I told you this in line with that L so from this bottom row of two what we want to do is do two bottom right diagonals so one two go down from here by two now from here we want to do two things so the first thing we want to do is go left from this block by one. The second thing we need to do is go down from this block by one. Just like that. So basically all we've done is go left by one and down by one. But from this last block we placed we want to do one bottom right diagonal. Go down by two. So one, two. We want to do another bottom right diagonal. And go down from it by five. So one, two, three, four, five. Then we'll do another bottom right diagonal. Go down from it by another five. So one, two, three, four, five. Again, one bottom right diagonal. And go down from it by seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We then we'll do one bottom right diagonal. Go down from it by one from this block we need to do two things to so remember this block right here 
Well, the first thing we want to do is seven bottom left diagonals. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Once you've done the seventh diagonal, we want to go left a bit by one. We then want to do two bottom left diagonals. So one, two. Go left a bit by one. We then want to do another bottom left diagonal. Go left from it by one. We want to repeat this four more times. So one bottom left diagonal, left by one. One bottom left diagonal, left by one. Another bottom left diagonal, left by one. Then one more bottom left diagonal, left by one. We then want to do another bottom left diagonal. Go left of it by two. So one, two. Again, one bottom left diagonal. But go left of this one by seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We then want to go on top of this last block by three. So one, two, three. From here, we want to do one up left diagonal. Go left. And what happened there? <laughs> when we want to go left, we then want to do one bottom left diagonal go left of it by one and if we've done everything correctly it should all connect with one bottom left diagonal which it does which gives us the outline of his head wow this is massive coming over to this row of three we just made right here before we connected it all so this row of three just right here shouldn't be too hard to find once you found it, here's what we're going to need to do. So, one upright diagonal. Go right from it by three. So, one, two, three. We then want to do one upright diagonal. Go right by one. We then want to do another upright diagonal. Go right by two. One, two. We then want to repeat what we just done one more time so one of right diagonal go right by two we then want to do one of right diagonal go right by one repeat this two more times so one of right diagonal right by one 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 of right diagonal right by one we then want to do two of right diagonal so one two and from this last diagonal we place, we want to go right from it by one. We then want to do one upright diagonal. Go right from it by one. We want to do another upright diagonal. Go right by two. Do another upright diagonal. Go right by one. Repeat this one more time, so one upright diagonal right by one and if we've done everything correctly it should all connect with one of right diagonal we now need to head back over to the block i told us to remember so it's over to the right hand side so luckily where we've just built it's only this block right here so once you've found it here's what we're going to need to do six bottom right diagonals so one two three four five and six from this last diagonal we want to go down by one we then want to do three bottom right diagonals so one two oh my god three go down by one do another bottom right diagonal go down by one we then want to do two bottom right diagonals one Oh my god two two and then go down from this last block by one again do another bottom right diagonal go down by one we 
you don't want to do one bottom right diagonal go down by one now from here we want to do two things so remember this block so where is it okay so it's on the outside on the right side I'm going to remember this block so to remember it you, you just could put like a yellow block in front of it to make it easier so let's just do that So the first thing what we want to do is go down from here by four. So one, two, three, four. We then want to do one bottom left diagonal. Go down by one. Then we'll do three bottom left diagonals. So one, two, three. Go left from this last diagonal by one. Then we'll do two bottom left diagonals. So one. One, two, and go left by one. We're going to do another bottom left diagonal. Wow. And go left by one. Do another bottom left diagonal. Go left by two. Repeat this one more time. So bottom left diagonal. Go left of it by two, one, two. We then want to do one up left diagonal. Go left of it by two, one, two. Do two up left diagonals. So one, <laughs> two. Go left from this block by one. We want to go down from this block by one. But we also want to go up from this block by one as well. From the last block we placed, we want to do one up left diagonal. Go up on top of this block by one. Do another up left diagonal. Go up by two. One, two. Then to finish it off, we want to do one up left diagonal. Then go on top of it by three. So one, two, three. It should give us something that should look like that. And that's his sleeve. Remember that block I told us to remember? So, this block that we place the yellow on top, well, in front of. And once you're here, what we want to do is go right from this block by one. We then want to do one bottom right diagonal. Go down by one. We want to do another bottom right diagonal. Go down from this block by three, so one two three we want to go right from this block by one but we also want to go down from the same block by one just like this from this last block that we just placed we want to do one bottom left diagonal we now want to come back up to where we place this one block to the right once we're here we want to do one bottom right diagonal and go down by four so one two three four we then want to do one bottom left diagonal go down by one do another bottom left diagonal go down by two one two from this block we want to do two things again so the first thing we want to do so let's just place a yellow in front first thing we want to do is go left from this block by one. We then want to do three bottom left diagonals. So one, two, three. Go left from this last diagonal by one. Do another bottom left diagonal. Oops. Go left by one.